to celebrate first frost. <laughs> be my most favorite season of the year. Okay now, let's make this whole place sparkle. some very cold weather moving in. Here, let me help. We'll get it done faster if we work together. first frost. <laughs> yes, here it is! It tells all about the first winter in Berry Bitty City. I bet everybody would love to hear it again. I'll read it here in the cafe and invite everyone in Berry Bitty City. Come on, you two can help! It's very beautiful. So original. So one of a kind. Well, thanks. I've been putting my whole heart into this entire collection. <laughs> you outdo yourself every year, Raspberry. I just feel, what's the point of doing something unless it's the best? So, I'm not stopping till I get it totally, completely, absolutely right. Like you said, I really want to make something original, one of a kind, never been seen before. Well, come on, Custard and Pupcake. We better let Raspberry work. Oh, I'm having a reading tonight at the cafe. I'd really like it if you could come. Huh? Oh, oh yes, of course. Mm, I'll be there. Pupcake. <laughs> Isn't it the most 
very beautiful thing you've ever seen? Careful, Pupcake. This berry is going to be our dessert at the very fest feast tomorrow. Look out! <laughs> Whoa! Are you all right, Berry Kim Blue? Uh, uh, yes, uh, thank you, Miss Shortcake. Uh, had a little stumble, took a little tumble, as I was looking for. <sighs> but you found it. Oh, my, my, my. Yes, yes, yes. A fine specimen this year. About the biggest I've ever seen. Oh, the color's so rich. The shape just so... The texture. Oh, amazing. Oh, and the aroma. Oh, yes. Perfect in every way. Oh, Custard, no. Yes, Pat, we must take care. There is but one of these delicious, nutritious berries at any given time. And how fitting that you, our new Berry Fest princess, should have found it. Found it? Found it? Who found it? Strawberry! Strawberry found it! <laughs> Look at it! Isn't it something? Unbelievable! It's incredible! Oh, oh, oh yeah! Now, now, you know the tradition. It's the Berry Fest Princess who plucks the berry. Oh, I knew that. Didn't you know that? I wanted no, to see if you did. Yeah. <laughs> Princess Strawberry? I'd be honored. Mm. Mm. Uh. Oh, harder! You can do it, uh -oh. Strawberry! Uh -oh. Give it a good shake! Oh, that's it! Uh. 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 <laughs> 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 oh, look! There it goes! At this moment, a new Wanderberry is springing up somewhere. Could it be here, or there, or there? We never ever know quite where. Oh, warm, spacious, and inviting. I call it perfect. Congratulations, Plum. Good for you! Good job! I did it! Yay for Plum! I knew you would! Plum, since you did such a wonderful job of finding the perfect spot, would you mind being in charge of the party preparations? Oh, I'd love to! Okay, let's see. Uh, I'll bring the dishes, cups, napkins, and tablecloths. Uh, Strawberry, can you take care of the party snacks? <laughs> of course! Okay, raspberry and orange. Would you help decorate? Fun! <laughs> Ooh, yay! What do you think of crepe paper streamers draped tastefully across the ceiling? Draped crepe? You got it! Blueberry, lemon, can you please round up as many glow bugs as you can to light the hall? Of course! We're on it! Raspberry and I'll get started too! And I definitely better get started if we want to put this all together in two days. Thank you, everybody! I'm gonna make this the best Glimmerberry Ball Berry Bitty City has ever had! Very nice, girls! Oh, it looks great! And the best part? We're a full day ahead of schedule! Ooh, which means I have time tomorrow to sew up some fancy tablecloths! Mm -hmm. And I have time to pick out some great music. <laughs> <laughs> the ball is going to be so much fun. True, but there's still plenty of work to do tomorrow. Let's get some rest, and I'll see you here bright and early. It's not funny. Who could have done such 
such a thing? <laughs> I don't know, but this is really cozy. Oh, I could take a nap in here. This is no time for a nap. <laughs> we have to start over. All that work we did. It'll be okay, Plum. We still have a whole day to put everything back in order. Sure. And I'll go round up some more glow bugs. What I want to know is who would do something so... so mean. Well, nobody in Berry Bitty City. Exactly. So it must be an outsider. And I'm going to find out who. And they will answer to the wrath of Plum. <laughs> Oh, now you don't like cranberries. Cupcake? <laughs> Watch out! Oh, how can I make cranberry cookies with you in the way? I told you I have a bunch of baking to do. <laughs> oh, come on, you silly puppy. We'll have playtime another time. Huh? <laughs> Strawberries Cafe, hoping you're having a very nice day. Strawberry speaking. Oh, hi, Plum. What? Uh-huh. You're all going to stay in the tree tonight? It's the only way to make sure nobody messes up the party stuff again. It sounds like a fun sleepover. Maybe I can join you later. I just have to make one more batch of snacks. Oh, hold on. Puffcake, go fetch. Bring me that oven mitt, okay, boy? It's the cranberry cookies, Blueberry's winter favorite. Oh, it makes me so happy imagining how much she'll enjoy them. Cupcake! Cupcake, no! like I'm not going to be able to join you after all. Why? Let's just say it was something out of my control. Good luck and have fun. See you in the morning. Bye. The case of the missing mangoes? <laughs> that was last month. This one is called Tennis Caper, anyone? Someone is cutting holes in the Toadstool Tennis Club's rackets and sabotaging the tennis tournament. I simply have to find out who's doing it and why they're doing it. It's outrageous! Well, that's an intriguing riddle. But I'm afraid you'll have to wait to find out who done it. Your package must be stuck at the branch in Barry Bitty Dale. Oh, I can't stand it. Refill? <sighs> no, thank you, Orange. I better get home before this wind gets worse. Well, be careful out there. I will. Blueberry is usually a very patient, even-tempered person. But if there is anything she is not patient about, it's getting to the bottom of a mystery. <laughs> Bosley Bookworm, are you all right? Are you... Where are you? Got in uh, some sort of net. Net? Uh, um, Blueberry? <gasps> Bosley, how'd you get in there? Uh, the door, uh, the wind blew. Uh, uh, oh, I'm sorry, Blueberry. I think I've wrecked your racket. Don't worry. This is a really old tennis racket. I was going to throw it away, but I kept thinking I might find something useful to do with it. Oh, if only it could somehow get me to Berry Bitty Dale. My patty persimmon is stuck there at the main post office. The butterfly bus is grounded and... and... Oh, that racket won't help you. What you need are some ice skates. I heard the roads were frozen over. I don't have any ice skates, but maybe I could make some. Oh, but even if those work, Berry Bitty Dale is a long way to ice skate. Hmm. Yeehaw! What is it, Custard? <gasps> Yahoo! That looked like a... Uh, no. <laughs> 
it couldn't have been. Could it? Nah. <laughs> are amazing! to memorize their lines. But the talent show is supposed to be a competition. Hmm? Well, I'm sorry, but I don't have time. If I'm gonna win, I have to put everything into my own act. Oh, I understand. You sure you don't want help washing that out? I'm sure. But thanks, Blueberry. Penguin? Slumber. I won't be needing it. Princess? Flum asked me to be in her belly, the flamingo and the hummingbird. 
I am dancing the flamingo! Oh! If you're the flamingo, who's the hummingbird? One, two, three, hoist! One, two, three, hoist! Do a hoist! One, two, three, hoist! The hummingbird is the bigger role. Hoist! Hoist! Lemon? Oh! <gasps> What's that? Hair topiary. Animal hair topiary. Scented. Well, uh, speaking of hair, we wanted to schedule our appointments. Sorry, girls, but as you can tell, I need every moment to practice. Oh. oh. Tiger? A bit more zebra, I think. Well, they both have stripes. <laughs> okay, so each team has a pen and paper for writing clues, and you all have your secret treasures. Mm -hmm. So how this treasure hunt works is, each team will write three clues. The first clue will lead to the location of the second, and so on. At each location, you will find a secret treasure. Whichever team finds the secret treasures first will win the jackpot, which is back in town, waiting. Just so we don't get in each other's way, why doesn't my team go this way? And Blueberry, your team could go that way. Good idea, Strawberry. Okay. We will have one hour to hide clues and treasure, and we'll gather back here afterwards. And then we can begin the treasure hunt. Yay! <laughs> Should do it. All righty, Earl. Let's get everything cleaned up. Oops. <laughs> hey, I think I left my skittle jinx by the cable queue joint. <laughs> what was that? talking about were you eating toast no no it attacked me oh you were attacked by a piece of toast well ed i'm i'm, I'm only telling you what happened i don't know how she can stand it who can stand what strawberry can stand working in a cafe that's you know haunted 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 there's no such thing earl Eesh, you and your fancy imagination. Well, Ed, I, I'm only telling you what... Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got work to do. Come on. Hm. You made me leave my Skittle Jinx behind again. Well, Ed, I, I didn't mean to... Wait for me! You stay up there! <sighs> Let the treasure hunt begin! Yay! <laughs> the first clue is, I'm open in the morning, closed at night. I am blue all the time. Isn't it glorious? Blue. Hmm. Oh, I know. Could it be Blueberry's bookstore? Her store is open in the morning and closed at night. What do you think, Cherry Jam? Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I'm so distracted about that song I'm supposed to be working on. Come on, Cherry. Get in the spirit. We need your help to win the treasure hunt. <sighs> You're right, Orange. Okay, let's see. 
Blueberry's bookstore? Well, it's not closed all the time at night. It's open sometimes at night for book club and, and Barrican story time. And Berry Bitty City is off limits for the treasure hunt, so I don't think they would have hidden the next treasure there. Blue all the time. Isn't it glorious? Why would it be glorious to be blue all the time? You know, blue isn't sad. Because you're Blueberry? Mm. I don't know. If it's not Blueberry, who is blue all the time? Mm. I know. Glorious. Glory. <gasps> A morning glory flower. And I know where they grow. <laughs> <laughs> for you. I never knew you were such a badminton ace. Neither did I. Great shot. Wow. Hooks, you are so good at horseshoes. Oh, just lucky. The wall finished. The Barricans are finishing installing the sprinklers now. The playground's already done. Will it be ready for the grand opening? Oh, yeah. We're ahead of schedule. All that's left is the big <laughs> entry, and it'll be... Cherry, what's the matter? My good luck. Charm, I can't, can't find it anywhere. What's it look like, Cherry? This big, on a chain, crystal, beautiful, all sparkly, and I can't sing at all without it. Cherry, you know you can sing. You don't need luck for that. But I do, Strawberry. I can't hit the high notes without it. Come on, Cinnapup. Look for it, girl. Find it. Remember, Cherry, we make our own luck with practice. Right, Huck? Huckleberry? Oh, Tom Tom, I know it's hers, but it's lucky for me, too. If I give it back, I'll be a klutz forever. It's gone, Cinnapup. It's gone. Cherry, hold on. Hi, Huck. What's up? I just... I wanted to tell you... You... Want to get some lunch? <gasps> I don't really feel like it. Thanks. Are you still upset about losing that... thing? Mm-hmm. My lucky charm. Maybe Strawberry was right. Maybe you don't need it. I tried to hit that high note without it. I couldn't. Cherry? Cherry, listen. Oh. I need to tell you something about that. Yo, Mr. Huckleberry, sir. Big news. Very big news. <clears throat> the Perrykin Builders Guild has decided to make you an honorary member of the Society of Extraordinary Engineers. Congratulations, boss. A rare honor indeed. Richly deserved by such a talented builder. That's fantastic, Huck. Don't know what to say, but I don't deserve this. Really, I don't. No one deserves it more. Nonsense!